Hey guys, welcome back. This is Izam, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how I paint this tulip in watercolor. Now, the difference between the real watercolor with uh, compared with a digital watercolor painting is that there are techniques for digital watercolor that are very different from real watercolor. Then I'm going to show you the technique how I paint the strokes and all using the Apple Pencil. I realized that using the Apple Pencil is very crucial here because you need the pressure of your fingers, of your hand movement and all that. Anyway, I'm going to show you now. So let's get on with the video. Now this is going to be a very quick video. I'm just going to show you the settings, the brush settings that I use that I found that will make the watercolor brush look more convincing. So what I did was, I used this particular brush and then I actually created it myself. So what I basically do is, I just add this, give the plus sign here, and then I just use this. I use the same head as the Monet brush, and then I set with all these settings. Now I'm just going to show you the settings here. I'm not going to explain much, just, I'm just going to show you, run through, and then you might want to replicate this if you like. Now the thing is, there are so many settings here and you can experiment it um, them yourself. So here are the settings that I find um, very good for, uh, to recreate a very realistic looking watercolor brush. So here they are. And the most important thing is this, the dynamics, the pressure, and the velocity. So these are the curves that uh, I find are suitable for a watercolor brush. Now the tilt um, is not really that great. So let's get to brushing. It's going to be a very simple thing to do. So set the opacity to 100%, set the color, and now we're good to go. So I'm just going to slow brush strokes like that. Another one here, and I'm just going to change the color. And another one here, like that. I'm going to change the color again to here, purple. Okay, like so, and I think uh, we're done here, somewhat, maybe I'll do some smudging, and the smudging is based on the watercolor brush for Monet, so I'm just going to have a quick stroke like that, just flick. Maybe I'll add more color here to darken it a bit. Okay, so now I'm just going to draw the uh, stem. The stem will be a dark brown color. Down. And this point. Alright, so now choose this, maybe this color. And we set opacity to 100% and broad stroke, another one, and last one. And this one also, broad strokes. So there it is. This is a tulip, or what my idea of a tulip is. So that's it. It is very easy to do and I think um, the effect, you can accentuate the effect by duplicating this, this layer, like that. Does this look better? Maybe. 
So if you duplicate this, you might want to merge it as well. And there it is. All right, so that's the watercolor painting of Tulip. I hope you find this video useful and if you do, give it a thumbs up. Do consider to subscribe because I will put up more videos like this in the future. So until then, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.